Hello and good afternoon everyone. Adam here at Kenyon Classic Cars in Clarence, Iowa. This afternoon I'm going to show you this 1950 Chevrolet Deluxe two-door sedan. This car is finished in black as you can see. The car features a ZZ4 350 crate engine with aluminum heads. The car has power steering, power brakes with disc brakes on the front. The car has a Mustang 2 front suspension underneath of it with rack and pinion steering, front sway bar. Like I said, it had disc brakes on the front. The rear end is a 9 inch Ford rear end. Um, guess that it probably has 355 gears, 373 maybe. Goes down the road very nice. It's got a 350 turbo transmission. The car goes down the road great. It doesn't wrap way out. It's very driver friendly. Super, super good looking little 1950 Chevy Deluxe. It's got a very, very nice look to it. Car's been done for some time. There's a few imperfections in the paint. The paint's not perfect on the car, but the car looks absolutely gorgeous. I mean, I can show you the, a few of the imperfections in the car. The interior in the car is super nice. Got a gray cloth interior, very soft, very comfortable seats in this car. It's got dual exhaust on it. Um, some nice sounding mufflers, like I say, nine inch Ford rear end. Um, just a great driving car. It does have the uh, fender screws in the trunk if you want to put the fender screws back on it. When I open the door, you will notice that this piece of glass has a crack in it. Um, that piece of flat glass is easy to replace. Flat glass is cheap and easy, so that's not a, a big deal. The windows all go up and down like they're supposed to. Interior, like I say, the interior in this car is really, really nice. Super comfortable seats. I'm thinking maybe the seats are original. They, they, they just been all redone, just like the back seat. Super comfortable back there too. I jumped back there just a little while ago just to see how comfortable it is and the seat is very comfortable. Headliner's in nice shape all the way around, all the way to the back. The back panel is in good shape. It's got one six by nine Kenwood speaker back there. That dome light, I don't, that dome light's not working. Has a low car shifter in it. Also has a uh, low car throttle pedal in it. The carpet's really nice. Door panels are really, really nice in the car too. There's your sill plates, your door jams. You know these jams aren't perfect. There's, they look like they might be all original in them jams. But super solid car. I looked underneath this car. Very, very solid car underneath. Um, the, the inner rockers, the floor pans, the cross braces, the body mounts, everything looks really nice on this car. The chrome bumpers are in great shape on this car. They must be new. All this bright work and all this stainless trim on the side looks great as well. All the way around the windows. The door handles are in good shape. The mirrors look nice. It does have wipers on it. That hood emblem on there, that's pretty darn cool hood emblem. We'll go ahead and open that hood for you so you can see the underneath the hood. There's the underside of the hood. Has a really nice aluminum radiator in the car. It's got a set of stainless headers on the car. Aluminum intake, Edelbrock carburetor, chrome valve covers, like I say, aluminum heads, power steering, power brakes, um, updated HEI distributor. The battery hold down's all there and in place. It's just a very well built car. There's your original um, data plate on the cowl panel there. Just a really, really well built car. It's been, like I say, it's been built for quite a while. I'd say this car's probably been done for 25 years. And yes, it has some imperfections in it, but this is a very hard car to find. You don't see that many of these cars running around anymore. And people are really, really excited to see these cars. Really nice set of like steel wheels with chrome outside, uh, black painted inside, the Chevrolet bow tie chrome caps. They really look great on this car. Show you the inside on this side as well. Seats, like I say, the very, very nice seats. Very soft material on them. When you sit on them, they're really, really nice. It's got a Lacara vintage, uh, vintage looking steering wheel on it. Car 
starts right up and runs great. Power steering works nice. It's got the original dash in it and all them gauges seem to work. Even the speedometer works on it. The blower motor works. It does have a radio mounted in the trunk or in the glove box. You won't see any stations. You won't see any stations in in here in the uh, in this building, but the radio does work. It's got all new wiring in the car. I don't think that horn is working. You can click the button. Click the button, but I, it clicks, but it doesn't do anything. Cigarette lighter works. Left turn signal, right turn signal. Bright headlight indicator and that dash works. I think it's just so neat they left the original dash in this car and all them gauges work. Somebody must have reworked that. Car sounds really, really nice. Tail lights work. There's your license plate lights. They both are working. Got the blue dot tail lights in it. It's a deluxe. 50 Chevy Deluxe. All that chrome in the front of this car, the grill, the bumper, the headlight bezels, they all look great. I'll show you some of the imperfections I'm talking about. It's got a few chips here in the hood on both sides when you go to open and shut the hood. You can see there, had some chips on it there. A couple chips there in the, on the hood. You know, it's got a few chips here and there. There's one here by the headlight, one here that's been touched up. Little spot right here. This isn't gonna be a $60,000 car. I'm probably gonna price this car at $29,900 got one spot here it's got a chip very very nice looking car like I say it's an older restoration but a nice car it does have a couple little chips here in the trunk this car is very driver friendly you can put your wife or your daughter in this car, send them down the road. I think you'd feel very safe with them in this car. It's hard to find a car that you can say that about, but like I say, it goes right down the road, runs good. It's got them headlight covers on the front. Them are pretty darn neat. Kenyon Classic Cars, Clarence, Iowa. Look us up on our website, KenyonAuto.com, K-I-N-I-O-N-Auto.com. Our phone number here at Kenyon Classic Cars, 563-452-2450. Give us a call today. We buy, sell, and trade collector cars, muscle cars, regular late model vehicles every single day. Give us a call, we'd like to buy your car. Um, if you got something to sell, we'd, we're really interested in buying it. We'll take your car on trade. If you wanna buy this 50 Chevy or any other car we have in inventory, give us a call. There's your turn signal, your four-way flashers, they work. I think it's a really, really good car. Somebody's gonna be really, really happy with this car. And the price is great too. You know, you just, anymore, you just don't buy anything that's worth a crap for 30 grand. And this thing is really, really a good car. I will have some undercarriage pictures of this car on my website um, probably tomorrow. So look for this car on my website. My picture guy shows up tomorrow. He'll put this stuff on for me. Like I pictured and videoed four cars today, so he'll be a little bit busy in the morning when he comes. Thanks for watching our videos. Please follow us on YouTube, Kenyon Classics, and you'll be up to date on every collector car that we get in stock. Thanks for watching. I hope everyone has a great night. I'm going home. It's 5.30. It's time for me to 
go home and relax. Have a great night, everyone.